Welcome back. Um, as you can see, I've been able to resize the cluster. Uh, so we have four nodes now. The next step will be to deploy a sample workload. So I'll be deploying a, a, a web server based on Nginx. So let's go back to our cluster. If I refresh this, this is four now. So click on workloads, click on deploy. Uh, you could also do these same steps using your YAML manifest, but I'll, I'll, the aim of this video is to do it via the um, Google Kubernetes engine console. Uh, so let's just follow the sample that they have here already. But if you have your container in a repo, you can also specify that here. Then connect your repo, maybe it's big bucket, GitHub, um, put your repository, your Docker file, then it builds the image automatically. But I'm selecting an existing image. Uh, so I don't have another image, but this is available globally. Um, no environments, nothing for now. So let's just click on done and continue our cluster I'm deploying to the cluster that we just created so this is the YAML file if you want to deploy via the YAML manifest so it's still the same step uh, so click on deploy it's pretty much straightforward So what, what this does is it deploys a pod uh, with a single container running the latest version of your Nginx. So it has autoscaler as well, minimum one, maximum is five. If we go back to workload, you should see that our deployment is successful. It has three pods. You can view what's going on here. Let's try to expose the service. Protocol TCP. So service type load balancer. So to so expose it. What this does is it allows us to be able to view uh, our the service the service that we just deployed. So it's creating new service waiting for the load balancer external IP. Hold on for a while. Either it's creating, we may want to look at the details of the container. Uh, so, look at details, namespace default because um, we didn't specify any namespace, so we use the default namespace. The update strategy is using rolling updates. This is beautiful. Ah. Um, CPU utilization is not pretty much not doing anything right now. Revision history, we've not done any revision. This is just the deployment itself. Events, nothing is going on right now. And this is the YAML file. Uh, we have the status page where it tells us the latest status. status. So if I want to edit this YAML, um, change the replica to 4, I can do that here. So, but that yet. Let's see if the load balancer service is up already. I think it's up. So 
to view these endpoints, you should click on Send Nginx. So you have your first deployment already uh, on Kubernetes. Thanks for watching.